He walks. Quiet. Now, what do we have here? Oh, one eye, send another god to do his dirty work? No. Thor too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing then. All right. You look cool. Holy shit. Freya? No, no. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye. Oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. My goodness. He sold my sister to that prick. It's rare. Broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me. Settle for blood. What? Stop! All right, thank you. What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Yngvi. There's no time to explain. Just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can't undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. Call them Ingvi? So. That's Freya, okay. You serve my sister. Oh. <laughs> <Not> <laughs> mm. Don't we all? Put him down. I like these people. I like this guy's sword over here. What's with leaving me hanging like that, you crusty hag? Oh, can it, Blobber? Come here. <laughs> well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Freya. That'll go well. This'll go just splendidly. Uh, Grok, what do you think you're doing? Just setting up shop at my fort? Just because I hug you don't mean I ain't still sore at you squabbling sandpipers. We fixed it so you can come and go between the realms whenever you please. You're very welcome. Go. This here's my family, and I mean much to you, but it means plenty to me. It does, too, mean something to me. Otherwise, I wouldn't have made up with my clunkerhead brother. Five million moon beams. I didn't realize the Hulk brothers were back in business. We're even cohabitating like a proper family. So don't tell me. <laughs> oh, okay, well, well, then you can help me at the forge while you spill everything. That's good. Now, Brock, ain't you gonna introduce me to this tall glass of milk you got for a bodyguard? <laughs> of course I was gonna. That's Kratos. Oh, you can call him whatever pops into your head. Kratos, Lunda. We go back. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. Oh, uh, so good. Love it. This is the loot I didn't pick up. Probably gonna be a lot. <laughs> Thanks for grabbing that for us. Okay. Not too bad. Let's do it. I need a redstone. Thank you. Wait, you can oh you can craft resources. 
with your hack silver. Oh, nice. I don't think I need it right this second. Oh, these are Atreus' stuff. Uh, this is the one I like. Melee attacks. No. Oh, this is another one. Using a health stone raise and refunds two runic arrow and further reduces runic summons cooldowns. Oh, see, I, he only gets he only gets three slots. When a runic summons on cooldown, significantly increase the status applied from runic arrows. I don't you know, know what, what I, you want. Not yet. I don't know. Need something special. Spiritual shoulder straps. These are new. Runic or relic uh, attack hits. Stack a buff, increasing Kratos' melee and range damage by 15% with each stack. How long does it last, though? Don't say that. These look pretty badass. Kratos' melee damage increases based on his rage. Incoming damage that would be lethal is absorbed by available rage. That's very defensive. Hmm. Hmm. I can't decide what I want. I think I'll hold off. No. Refunds. Do, 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 do. How do you feel about spending so much time playing another character such as Kratos? Oh my god, I love it. I love that you have so many different pairings. Um, different characters to have dialogue with, different abilities with the sub characters, and and the Treus is super fun to play with as well. It hasn't been a lot of time, just like a couple couple little segments, but yeah. I love it. All right, so who are these people? We wish this camp kept secret. Understood? I will not compromise it. No, we wouldn't dare. Good. I like him. I like his sword. What about you guys? Hello, servant of Freya. Do not speak to him. Shouldn't you be moving along now, stranger? Perhaps he can help. There's no reason to be unfriendly. I can think of at least a dozen. Leave us. Tend to your bird. <laughs> Bela? Wow, she was unfriendly. But the mummy was kind of nice. Yeah. Hey, loot. I can't do this. I mean, I have to do this. I write this because I can't say the words out loud. I write this because maybe if all goes well, it'll be a funny reminder of the man I once was. A man who is scared, who is in over his head. A man who cannot stop asking himself over and over again a single question. What would she do? I'd love to ask her, but she's gone, so I guess I have to answer on her behalf. She'd tell me to stop complaining. She'd tell me that I don't matter. That my fears, my anag- anag- My inadequacies are irrelevant. All that matters is making sure the people of Vanaheim can cast off the yoke of Aesir rule. She'd tell me I'm allowed to be scared. I'm allowed to be angry. But above all, I have to be strong. The people of Vanaheim need a leader. And for the foreseeable future, it looks like I'm the best they're gonna get. Man. I wish she were here. And now she is. And now she is. All right, Mimir. Let's go make this reunion here. This is not going to go well. Sorry, we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. We're pretty used to only seeing Ace here in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That. That is a friendly face, right? 
Uh, his name is Kratos, and no. The Aesir are in Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Uh, I lost count. What is your plan? Suka working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Oh, I'll take what I can get. Oh. Your right. mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. Hey, Kratos. As long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. She's not too big on forgiveness. <laughs> yeah, we've noticed. We have noticed that. We have met Freyr, the brother of Freya in Vanaheim. He is an unusual god, roguish, not as impressive as his sister. Yet his allies seem loyal and include many I would not expect to cooperate. He does not resemble any great leader I've known, nor does he share their strengths. What makes him so able to unite former enemies? And will it work for Freya? A bit late for that one, I'm afraid. All right, let's see what we've got here. Tell me about your army. Oh, you're looking at it. What, you five? Stop. You don't like that I've started my Christmas shopping, do you? She hates it. She hates all these packages coming in. There's like five boxes in his office that I can't open. Like, I don't know what's in them. I know it's for me. Not for you. These are for me. Is it now? Yep. Is it? Yep. I'm sure. They're for the, it's for the kids. Oh. Okay, is that why you said that when these boxes come in, I, me, me, Azaria specifically cannot open them? Yes. Okay, yeah. When you lie, your voice gets higher. It does? <laughs> Against Odin's army? Well, six if you count the dog. Oh, fuck me. Yep. Do you know their numbers? Oh, yeah, numbers, only got five. outposts. We have good intel. Uh, just short on help. Let me see that map. I see. Well, let's have a look at the map then. Kratos is standing awfully close. <laughs> well, they got friendly in a hurry. <laughs> oh, man. So they got five of them plus a dog, as they said? Where's the dog? Freyr's pretty charismatic. Yeah, and Kratos is Spartan. So. Oh, I didn't even see the dog there. It looks like a piggy. How do you not... How could you not pet it? Look at the sploot! Sploot! Hi, Dublinari. Meetings are finally done. Just in time to see Bog wrap up, wrap up, no doubt. Yeah, pretty soon. Pretty soon. Sorry that you had such a busy day. I like the boat. That's a nice boat. We're in Vanaheim. First time being in this realm. So it looks like they want us to go that way. What's this way? Who's the fifth though? Him. One, two, three. Oh, and the dwarf. Lunda. Lunda is the fifth. Yeah. You missed the God of War I'm sorry, go with them, Larry. There's always the VOD to catch up on. It's a really, uh, it's a really... We've had a lot of fun today. It's been a really story-filled, uh, day. Alright, so... They want me to go up here? Okay, so I go through that gate. So I can explore over here. Let's see what's over here. <laughs> Here's the fifth one, Golomancy. This guy. 
little dude. He he's a helper. Brock get a girlfriend. They have a history. Yeah, that's what they said. Can't do anything to this, right? That's a later. Ah. Uh, he called her an old drinking buddy. Yeah. I don't have the head, so head. I can't see that either. Sounds like a girlfriend. Yeah, an old drinking buddy. This whole thing's going to be later. All right. All right, well, this is probably a good stopping point then before we go on our uh, adventure with Freya. I can't get ahead of him. You're trying to catch up on all the jokes you missed out on? Yeah, this is a pretty good point to call it. Yeah, yeah, we're just about to start something new. So, more God of War tomorrow. Yeah, we're going to finish up the week. More God of War tomorrow. Full week of God of War. Uh, next week, we're going to sprinkle in other games as we continue to play through. Um, yeah, this game. This game, though. This game, though. Yeah, the week of war. Week of War.